Hey! How many of you guys have a brother that's always late? We're ready to go fishing and he's jacking around with coffee cups. I absolutely love coming to places like this and watching people do what they do. Yesterday we were at the fish market where these people were selling their fish and now to see a husband and a wife out here in a little dugout canoe throwing their cast net, something that I love to do, touches my heart. Now we're going offshore looking for billfish and big tuna. I'm filming you, you're filming me. We're both saying, thank God we got out of there when we, we did. This is the calmest I've ever seen the ocean. It's like we're running through oil. It's just slick, slick calm. Elon, let's not get too close right away. Let's let's get up in front of them and figure out what direction they're going. I just saw about a 70 pounder air out. Look right on her birds. Those are all yellow fish. There he is. Oh my goodness. The key to this success is getting in the water at the right spot. We want to go all the way around them and then we'll ease into the water. Keep going this way. The biggest fish are going to be next to those porpoises right there. That is about as many tuna as I've ever seen in one spot in my life. I sure hope y'all can see it and I hope you can hear me. This is amazing. Are you kidding me? Aubrey! Aubrey! Hey! I'm filming about a 400 pound blue marlin! Well, you guys, this was one of the most epic moments of my life in the water. I could have speared him in the eyeball just sitting there swimming circles around me. 
he would come straight to me. I'm, my gun's unloaded, so I'm like trying to film him with my, with, I'm like, then I'm holding this so the, the shit, this isn't in front of it. He swam around me for the longest time, come up, go down, all around me. But when he was coming, he was coming straight up. Oh my goodness. 400 at, at least. I just had to take a shot. <laughs> Eddie, y'all get one? Did you miss? Oh, I got one. Not a giant, but a tuna. You know what they say, you can't eat them if you don't shoot them. How cool was that? Hey, you know what you say, you want to kill something big, you got to break out the American flag board shorts. Look at this, you guys. Birds everywhere. Tuna's blowing up. Look at me. That's a big Woo! one. That's a big one. Yeah, man. Look at this. Hey. Bingo, go down, Chiquito. Look, the float's coming. Yeah. Oh, he's under, he's under. He's under. Yeah, right now. That is not easy. That is not easy. But I finally hit one. I have missed and missed and missed. When he towed that. Did I tell you I was committed? You told me you were committed. Am I rolling? Yeah. Grandote bicho, Roberto Villane! Are you kidding me? First, it's a blue marlin, now I got two sailfish. This is the most epic thing ever. I'm like swimming in space with wild fish. Monster fish. Thank <laughs> you. 
Y'all ever heard of a dad bod? Boom, right there you go. This has been one of those trips, one of those days, one of those memories that I'll never forget. Lon, Lupito, Brito Mas Grande. What's up? Life ain't crepe. It's good stuff, you guys. Day. It was an amazing day. Look at that. Look how similar we are. No, you, you got it. <laughs> hey, I just hope you guys understand how much fun this was. This is how we really roll, y'all. We got guacamole, chips, little pico de gallo. We got our boy Luvito, Cappy running. Yeah, boy. Brito. Woo. You got it. Rock and roll. Look at that. We got the tomatoes, guacamole. Got some chips. They may not. They may be homemade. Maybe not. I don't know. Who knows? Hold on. Alright you guys, so here's the scoop. Yesterday, we were out on the monkey business too. We absolutely smashed the tunas. We speared a bunch, we caught a bunch, we had an amazing day. Well, Jody, this is the owner and, owner and operator of the lodge. One of the most giving, one of the nicest guys I've ever met in my life. He's an awesome dude. I mean, he's got a beautiful wife, awesome family. I just couldn't tell you enough good things about this guy. Well, what do you want to do? I said, let's give it away. So not only are we giving it away, we're gonna cook it. So if we're cooking anyway, let's cook it up. That's right. So we've got a lot of people from town coming here that would otherwise never be here. And we're gonna fire up the grill, we're gonna set up a whole line, and we're just gonna feed a whole bunch of people. We're gonna have a party tonight, and that's just the way we roll. Absolutely, baby. You know it? Yeah. Baby. That's awesome, bro. Austin, what exactly is going on here? Hey, I'm hungry. I'm trying to get this fire going. The drone expedition. Hey, that where there's a will, cool. there's a way, baby. That's that right. is pretty cool, I'm telling you. That's cool. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's In life, if it's going to rain, don't let it rain on your parade. Just roll with it. I'm sitting here filming. Austin's filming. They're cooking. Next thing you know, we got a downpour. It was so cool because everyone just snapped into action. We moved everything indoors. And you know what? We didn't miss a beat. Well, I got those poblanos, grilled avocado, grilled zucchini, grilled asparagus, the tuna poke Robert just made, and some rice that's about to get real. We're getting some eats on. Even with the rain shower and everything that's going on, it's just a real blessing to be here. Uh, this is my third trip to Guatemala. This is the third trip to Guatemala. The first time I came to Guatemala was 15 years ago. I knew that the fishing was amazing 15 years ago. Last year, whenever I came here, El año pasado, cuando vino, I realized how amazing the people were. Me di cuenta cómo las personas trabajan, la cultura de Guatemala. Sí. In my country, in the United States, en mi ciudad, en los Estados Unidos, 
people don't know. They're scared of Guatemala. Las personas no saben. Ellos le tienen miedo a Guatemala. But you have an amazing, wonderful, beautiful country. Pero ustedes tienen un No, tenemos un hermoso país. We have a lot. Nosotros tenemos un hermoso país. I'm telling you guys right now, I had to reaffirm it to Aubrey. Yeah. Aubrey sent me a letter from the State Department. It looked like we were going to some terrible like war zone. War zone. I'm like, bro, trust me, this place is amazing. And to everybody watching this video, man, I just hope you understand as we come out of COVID and people start to travel, this country, Guatemala, is amazing. There's a lot of lodges here, but all I know is this one, the people, whether you're just walking around the grounds, whether you're here getting breakfast or you're on the boat, what we've experienced here is unlike any place I've ever been. It's really, really special. And it's, tell him, it's an honor to be here with you today. Serious. Hey, como se llama, señor? Waldo. Waldo? Por favor, say the blessing for us. Thank you. Damos las gracias a Dios por esta oportunidad que nos regala estar reunidos a uh, New Family, right. una nueva familia, eh, por esta oportunidad que nos regalan, por también el cumpleaños de sí. nuestra amiga, nuestra empresa. Así es de que todos inclinemos nuestro rostro y le damos gracias al Señor. Señor Dios, en esta noche te damos gracias por la oportunidad que tú nos permites estar reunidos. En este lugar, el Señor bendice a cada uno de los que nos hicieron parte de esta gran fiesta. Te damos muchas gracias por las personas, Señor, de humilde corazón. Gracias por este lugar, por este negocio, por el dueño, por los trabajadores, por cada uno de los que hacen realidad este negocio. Te pedimos, Señor, que bendigas este negocio, que bendiga a las personas que laboran, los dueños, a todo mundo, Señor, por favor, por este gran afecto, Señor. Muchas gracias te damos en esta preciosa noche. La gloria y la honra es tuya, Señor Dios. Muchas gracias. Gracias, Padre. Gracias, Hijo. Y gracias, Espíritu Santo. Amén. Amén. Y amén. 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 Here's the funny thing, you guys. This all turned into this. But this just started out wanting to give fish away. It's amazing when things just happen like this. Vamos a comer. Finalmente. Huh?